as much as we try to get this workout concluded, the headlines of the day just won't let us. And uh, trending over the last hour, Anthony Scaramucci, who came as a hedge fund guy from Wall Street to Pennsylvania Avenue, and he took control early with that very first press conference as the new White House communications director, longtime friend of Donald Trump. But then Ryan Lizza, the interview that went viral with the New Yorker, talking about leaks and pointing fingers at uh, people like Rents Primus and more. And a lot of profanity in that article that went to print. And now Mr. Trump, our president, is going to be looking for a new White House communications director because Anthony Scaramucci, just days on the job, is out. So once again, today, former Homeland Security Secretary John Kelly sworn in as the new chief of staff, stating, yes, I am the man in charge, and Anthony Scaramucci is out. It just continues to go round and round as far as the administration and what they're doing, trying to put all the right people in the right place amongst all of the fireworks. So what are we going to do tonight? Just moments ago, I have concluded booking two, I believe, very good guests to describe exactly what this means. We'll be joined right after local news at 8 with Joe DeStio from our political correspondent, Bill Green. He'll also be with me on Friday as I'm in for Mike Pintech from noon to 3. And then in the 9 o'clock hour, Dr. Terry Madonna from the Franklin and Marshall Polling Center will be here. So White House Communications Director no more. Anthony Scaramucci is out, trending in the last hour. CBS Radio News, News Radio 1020, KDK right now with the latest. And then tonight, Bill Green on the Disk Institute of Pittsburgh Newsline after news at 8. And then after CBS Radio News at 9, Dr. Terry Madonna. Have a great day, and we'll see you later tonight with Rob Pratt Monday night starting at 7 with the Allegheny Health Network program, Medical Frontiers. Good afternoon.